Hey. What? You're live. What? Man, you're going to stop doing this crap. Well, I guess hi, I'm Wes from JNW Sports and Apparel. I think she's thinking this is funny and stuff. Well, I looked outside looking at the weather, and at the old place, I used to give you the weather forecast. Today, I have no clue. <laughs> it could be cold. It could be. It ain't cold. You crazy. <laughs> I wish it was cold. Our air conditioning is a little down right now. Uh, we had uh, issues with our air, so if you come in, it's a little hot, but we're working on it. So it's just, all good, though. Yeah. We're, uh, it's uh, being took care of. We just uh, just bear with us right now until we get the air fixed. Mm -hmm. But uh, we have another signing, and uh, it's going to be August the 14th. You're going to have to move. There's a glare. Uh, <laughs> August the 14th, and uh, let me make sure. I don't want to butcher his name. D'Angelo Tyson, I think is how he says his name. D'Angelo, yeah. Uh, D'Angelo, he had a... Uh, Everybody's heard about it. It's all over the internet. Uh, he has colon cancer at the age of 32. So we're doing a uh, benefit uh, found, uh, fundraiser. And John Clayton told me, and we're excited about this. Uh, we're glad that he's going to help uh, D'Angelo out. And Rennie Kern, everybody asked how we could get Rennie back. And Rennie's already told. I guess John's already put it in there. And we got another one that everybody loves, too. We've got surprises. Oh. We've got a we got a few this. Good morning, Matt Bricky. We've got a lot of different ones that's coming, and actually we're allowing uh, Rini to bring these guys. So it's a surprise, folks. We don't know. We don't know who he's bringing. He wants to help uh, D'Angelo with the situation he's got. So come out. It's a fundraiser, and uh, just be a big <coughs> bulldog supporter. And he really needs this. I mean, the GoFundMe. I think he's got a GoFundMe page, and John can put it in there if John Clayton's in here or Nate Lee. And uh, you can go in there and actually uh, GoFundMe. But he's uh, been diagnosed with uh, uh, colon cancer, and that hits hard with me because my dad uh, had cancer. And so far, he's free of cancer. So it can be done, so we just need him to be able to pay for his doctor bills. And he's got kids, so... We want to make sure that we do everything to help him and his kids. So, uh, D'Angelo Tyson, uh, come out August the 14th, 12 to 4, and uh, just come out and support a Bulldog. I know a lot of people are Bama fans, uh, Florida fans, but he's got colon cancer. And we, we need to help him out as much as we can. So let everybody know if you have a friend that's a Bulldogs fan, tell them to come out. The JNW Sports is doing a fundraiser for this thing. And we want to make sure we have uh, D'Angelo a lot of uh, money to take care of the uh, medical bills and everything where he won't have a burden of dealing with that. Because he's got a lot on him, folks. And just a lot of prayers will be good for him. But, uh, but we want to thank... Uh, Martrez Milner. Good morning, John Clayton. Uh, Big Max. Uh, Vince Vance. Uh, let's see, who else? Uh, De Demarius Dewberry. Uh, we want to thank him. And we want to thank... Uh, Good morning, Tim Sonny. We want to thank uh, Zamir White, a.k.a. Zeus. And we want to thank Kyrish Jackson for showing up our last signing. Uh, them young men are great that kids. That was a great day. They are great kids. The The moms and dads who raised them should be very proud of them. They they were very mature. Because usually when a kid is a kid, but they were very mature for their age. And I, I, it was a pleasure. for Me and Julie really enjoyed them. And we want to thank Food City. Food City uh, supplied the food. We want to thank Food City for and what they did. And thanks to their family for letting them come. Oh, yeah. Yeah, thanks for the family. And Morris, uh, Kyrus's dad, me and him have been talking. And hopefully we can get Kyrus back up here. And uh, I'm hoping to meet Morris and his wife and everything, Kimberly. But anyway, we've got a few things Show we that. still have. This is cool. It's a custom helmet that's made. Yeah, it's, it's custom made. It's 150 bucks. You can't see it, but it's got a bulldog head on the side. Yeah, it was let me see. custom made. I can take it out. Let me show it to them. I don't worry about taking it out. Now, hold on. It's 150? Yeah, 150. It's custom made hat. Or not hat, helmet. 
Yeah, they custom made this one. That's a cool helmet. Mm -hmm. It's 150 and shut. But it, we got that. We got two pylons left. Yep. They went quick. Yes. It was, uh, yeah. All the bulldogs we had, uh, the place went crazy. We got the bulldog head. Yep. If you buy one for 30, and then, and get or, two, or two you get for two 50. for 50. Oh, speaking of curious, we have his photos still. They're eight by tens. Tell who made the photos. I mean, oh they're... yeah, Danny. Awesome well, photos. Yeah, he's this is the guy that made his photos. Danny Reagan. He done great. He is amazing on his photos. He Look made at that. this. That is pretty. He is really good. And he and see Curious is calling himself Action Jackson, so he actually printed it down there. So I mean he he's really good. Danny uh done a great job. We still got a lot of other autographs too. Yes. We actually... He said Danny Reagan the third. The third? Okay. That's what John said. Okay. I guess, you know, I'm going to butcher somebody's name, so I did Danny. Sorry, Danny. Yeah, day still early. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. But anyway, uh, let's see here. Oh, Georgia Bulldog Cups. We got a few of them still left. Yeah, hot days like this, you, mm -hmm. you need these cups. Yep. And We uh, got all kinds of cups. We still have some Georgia hats over there, too. Yeah. And visors. I'm supposed to be getting some fitted hats. And I like going out. through and just showing stuff because people come and they said they see it on the video. Yeah. Now we got one of these left. Yes, yeah, the last one. The Columbia. Still got beach towels. Yeah, got those. Oh, and we still got some. If you want just a football jersey, we still got these for forty. Yeah, they're forty bucks. It's getting closer to football yeah. time, people. We still got cutter and buck. We've got a few of them left. They're going pretty good. Cutter and buck. Go show the new Braze hat. Oh, yeah. We got the new Braze hat. This has been selling really good since I got them in. This is the 4th the, uh, July hat. Independence Day. Yeah. Yeah. That was a pretty hat. Mm-hmm. They've been selling good. And it's made by New Air. Yep. I'm really happy with our company we, uh, with New Air. And then we got this one. That's our last one. Yeah, it is. And it braves on the back. And then we got this, this one here. That's the last one. Yep. Like that. And then we got the traditional one. John said he forgot to get his Marshall County hat and shirt. Oh, yeah. <laughs> John Clayton? Yeah. He met Murray County. <laughs> Are you correcting him now? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we're Murray County. We're not Marshall yet. We still got him, John. Yeah. We yeah, he that. corrected himself. He put Murray. <laughs> yeah. So we got that. Yeah, next time you can get one. Yeah. And then we got <laughs> these here. These are snapped back by New Air also. Yeah, people like, some people are liking the snapback again yeah, for some reason. For some reason, yeah. <laughs> so we've got a little bit of everything, folks. Florida. Yeah. Oh, we got, okay. It's the same hat. Okay. And then we got these over here. This is for your bigger. He lock. said dang auto correct and messed them up. <laughs> these are the bigger hats. If you can read that, 2X. X. Two extra lock, yeah. XX yeah. large. Yeah. It's a bigger hat. That's a cool hat. It's pretty so good. it's Atlanta Braves, and everybody said, "Can you get bigger hats?" These are the bigger hats. Twenty-eight dollars. Mm -hmm. Yep, good. You read that. Now we got these. They were uh, hat, they wore these last night. But it's a snapback. Yep. Braves, and it is twenty-five dollars. That could be for a man or a woman. Yeah. Now, speaking yeah. of women's, we got a women's uh, Georgia hat here. Oh yeah. Grab it real quick. John Rapper said that's for Barry Bonds' head. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it was right there. <laughs> well, shoot. I went over and grabbed one. It this says is a lady. Women. See, I'm get a close up of it. See, it's yeah. like a. And plus, it tells you right here. So you letting y'all me and know this is a woman's hat. <laughs> yeah. Right here, 47 lets you know it. Yeah, women's. Yeah. And it's a snap back for a woman. Yeah. Uh. We still got floor mats. Mm -hmm. Uh, we've only got one pair of Georgia. John Max. said Big Mac's head. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And let me tell you a funny story about Big Mac's. Big Mac's had, back when he played football, he actually had 
to uh, take and uh, they had to make his own helmet. So the normal helmet, if there's football players out there, is a normal helmet. It fits certain people. He had to actually have his made. Well, we had a hat, and I told Otis Nixon I wouldn't mind having a, a shack up here to give him a Atlanta Braves hat. It was an 8.18 hat, I think of what it was. It was big. It was big. You put it over and it'd be up, right here. And I, Big Max was sitting there, and he said, I can't find a hat that fits me. And Julie goes, get the shack hat. So I took the shack hat over, and he went, now that's what I'm talking about, hats that fit. It fit his head, folks. I said it was like Cinderella finding yeah, her glass it slipper. Was, it was. <laughs> and so he was like, he said, I love that hat. He said, New Air, he said, that's a good hat. So New Air actually makes a big hat for his head. He was shocked. So they have oversized hats. The way New Air hats work, I know some of them are like flex fit top hats, small, medium, uh, medium, large, and large and extra large. Well, the real good ones that they that they charge more for, and I can get them, is like a seven and one eight, or uh, you know different sizes. I need to know specifically what your size of your hat is, and I can get them. Show the new uh, Tennessee Vol stickers. Oh yeah, we got some new ones yeah, in. Yeah, we got those in. They're right there on the side, right here. Oh yeah. Straight ahead. Yep. And then we got the bigger one over here too. Yeah, we got this one. Mm -hmm. This is like a what size? That's a six. And I got Smokey here. Yep. I like that one. And there's three inch. Yeah, and this is Lady Volunteer, so for basketball. And then we got that one. Yeah, we got the bigger ones here. Mm -hmm. We yeah. even have uh, Kennesaw State decals, I yeah. think. Actually, one of uh, Kyrus's uh, yeah. buddies got one. Yeah, he goes he went, to Kennesaw he went to State. Ken he went to Kennesaw State, so we got Kennesaw State stickers. Yeah, and he good got morning, one. Brian Bain. He got one. That's Kennesaw. We got the Monks, so yeah. if you got any Monks fans out yeah. there. Y'all need to support these local boys that are going there. We got one pair of them left. Yeah. That's it. One this pair. is our last set of formats. So we'll be getting more in, though. though. Just bear with us. Uh, oh, John Clay says Nate Lee has two Georgia Tech players, mm -hmm. one Auburn player, and a few dogs coming to a signing on August the 28th. I remember that. One of them, I can't think of his name, and I don't want to butcher his name. John will put it on there His lady. last name is Jackson. They say he's one of the top linemen, defensive linemen, current defensive linemen this year for the Georgia Tech ACC, uh, supposed to be the top top dog. So if you want to come out, if you're Tech He fan, said Quez Jackson. Quez Jackson, yeah. He uh, is supposed to be here to 28. See, I always, when people come in, they know my slogan, what kind of fan are you? Well, a lot of people think that it's all about Georgia, and I love that I do think that, but here's the deal, folks. I'm in the business to make sure everybody's happy. So we got Georgia Tech players coming in, Nate Lee's working on, which he's already said that. We've got Auburn players is going to be coming. Alabama eventually, Tennessee, and Florida players. Yeah. So we're not we just, just making gotta, all, we just gotta we're going to do a variety out. of yeah. different ones. And, you know, a lot of people have said, when are you going to bring Otis back? We're working we don't on, know. Down the road, we're working on Otis, too. So Otis uh, could pop in here and say, hey, I've already talked to John, and this is what's going to happen. So we never know who's next. Yeah. But you need to come out to these events because people show up out of the blue. Yeah, the they time. do. You never know who's coming in. So Show these UTC. Uh, we got tags, too. Oh, yeah. And that Georgia Southern. You need to show them. Yeah. These are for the local schools. Yeah, for the local schools around here. Because we got kids going here, too. We ain't forgot about them. That's Georgia Southern. Yep. It's 20 bucks. And then we got down there. There's two UTC ones down yep. there. Yep. Trying to get it out. <laughs> we got one left. Yeah, UTC. And yeah. then, yeah, we got some kids, uh, North Murray kids going to. Danny Reagan the third said, Ola. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Hello. And we there's got that one. Yeah, and then there's another one over here that says Monks. Yeah. I forgot about I mean. Yeah, we've got I some I mean, Monks. we're you got to support these kids that are going there, too. Yeah. So, so we got some stuff. Yep. Yeah. And we've got keychains that came in. Yeah. Let's go over here. There's a few keychains. Oh, advertisees. Yeah, here's our slides. Yep. They're nice. They're like a, they, they fit like a tennis shoe. Yeah, they really, feel good. Real I love mine. She got her some uh, right here. We got a, a Kennesaw State. Oh yeah, and a Mox. Yeah, there's Tennessee. We got one. We've got one Kennesaw of those. State, and Let's that see right there. This other one. 
It's the same one. Oh, we I got thought two. we had a Mox. No. There it is, right here. Oh, okay. Yeah. So, they're six dollars. Six dollars, and uh, we still got a variety of ladies' earrings. Yep. These oh, were selling a lot of hotcakes Saturday. We still got custom helmets. Yes, custom helmets. Sixty-five hat. bucks. Yep. These were selling good. Yep. They sold good for the sun. And Show the night light. Oh yeah. It's a night light. You walk by it and it comes on. It says automatic on at dusk, off at dawn, LED night light. It's yeah, Georgia. It's 15 bucks. And I don't know if they have them in the other teams. I'm yeah, not just sure. Have, we'll have to look and see. We just happened to see that one. Yeah, and, and brought it in. Okay, koozies. Oh, yeah. Atlanta Braves koozies. It's one side. And that's one side and that's the other. It's, I thought they were pretty. Mm hmm. So it's got two sides. And then uh, you got the uh, sticker there. Are they yeah. just selling good? Yeah. Oh yeah, this in here. The Be back. careful, they stick together. So. Yeah, the bat one here. They'll grab them up two at a time if you don't watch. Yeah, I think that's pretty cool with the bats. There's another one somewhere. Uh, it's over there where that mannequin's at. Okay. Let me go around here. Over here. Yep. It's right here. You get two. It's a yeah. two pack. Oh yeah. I forgot about them. See, we got so much stuff. It's hard for me to remember what Says we got. Says this is Bray's Country. You'll get two stickers for ten dollars. Yep. It's a two pack. Yeah. And then we got. Uh, I need to move them over there. Yeah. I'll do that in a minute. Uh, let's see. There's a. Uh, oh, sunglasses. Yep. Got still a few sunglasses. But like I said, we got Braze eye slides too. That's what I'm wearing right now, folks. These so, are so comfortable. Yeah, they are. They feel like a tennis shoe. They're really. I like wearing mine around the house. But yeah, they're. Like what's the? They're forty five dollars. If you see them cheaper somewhere else, you know we'll drop the price. Yeah, we're you, a dealer for them. You so just have to let us know. Just let us know what the price is because we're a dealer for them also. Uh, there's something else. Oh, did we ever show this? Yeah. Uh, for the again. Kyle Larson fans, this is number 42. They sent this. And, and we here, have his tag somewhere. Yeah, oh, oh, it's right here. Right there. Oh, yeah, right here. It's a plastic tag. Mm -hmm. And then we got this in here. But look what it says, adjustable bottle This opener. is before he changed his number. Yes, yeah, what they said. So this is more like a old school hat. It's got a bottle. Bottle op cap opener. opener. So for you true rednecks out there. Like, look, -hoo -hoo, pop, yeah, let me pop let me top. just pop a beer. Let's let's rock and roll, baby. It's racing time. It's racing time. So yeah. We got that now. There's yeah. two over here. And uh yeah, we got this one. I thought this was pretty cool. This is him too. Ganassi, Chip Ganassi racing. And it's him also. It's more like a tie dyed look or a yeah. smoky look to me. Yeah, it says uh, burnout. Hat. Yeah, it's so what it's, it looks like smoke. Yeah, smoke from a you car. You just had to come in and look at this. It. it looks like it's smoke. Yeah, they said it's a burnout uh, hat. That's what it's called. It's 30 bucks. And then we got a military hat. That it's his too. That's a pretty hat. Yeah. For the arm for honorable, uh, honor, honorable and remembered. Yeah. And this is him also. Yeah. It's got camouflage here a little bit, you see. Oh, I didn't notice that. It does. You just yeah. have to look at it. It's just Yeah, it's, it's got hat. camo inside it, too. I like that. Yeah. But anyway, we tried to bring a little bit of everything in racing. Uh, oh, I'm going to be on the radio. i got to get with them and find Again? Out again, for what well, we're doing, it for a good, good thing, because uh, I'm going to talk about the fundraiser for... D'Angelo Tyson's uh, fundraiser we're going to do here August the 14th. Uh, I'm supposed to get with John, and John's going to let me know who's all coming. It'll be 12 to 4, so be surprised. Be surprised. Yeah, you never you know, know who's going to show up. <laughs> you'll never know who's going to show up. So uh, we're letting Rennie handle this and John handle it and Nate. So we don't know who it is. Yeah. I mean, he could pop in and tell you who they are. But just uh, remember, uh, I will try to be on the radio. And the way I've got it set up now, if I got uh, Captain Bobby Bird recording our audio, so that way I can share it out. So if y'all are not up in the morning when I when I'm on the radio with Captain Bobby Bird, we'll share it to the page. We'll share it to the page and YouTube and everywhere else, Instagram and everywhere. Speaking of Big Macs, show that. That's a pillowcase. Take yeah. it. Take it out. Yeah. We got a pillowcase. For Philadelphia Eagles. I mean, you could probably get a sign. I mean, yeah. Or if you're a Philadelphia Eagles fan, it's a big yeah. pillowcase. Yeah. And it's $10 is yeah. what we're selling it for. Yeah. Yep. 
pellet case. Nate Lee said, John, no Auburn player confirmed yet. Still working on that bit. Okay. The rest are confirmed, yes. Okay, good. Yeah, we've got two signings going in August, y'all. We've got the 14th with Tyson, uh, the fundraiser. And then we've got August the 28th. Uh, and we're going to, the way uh, Nate and John's done that, we're going to have, I think, a Georgia player coming the 28th, and we're going to have two Georgia Tech players coming. Mm -hmm. So you have your variety of players, and we're hoping to get some more. That way, that day is all about the other SEC schools that they're working on. So it ain't, people's like, well, why are you not, you're bringing these in. Every time you step through that door, I say, what kind of fan are you? So we're, we're coming out of the box and going with everybody else. Yeah. We're trying to and get see it, how it goes. We see how it goes. If you guys keep liking it, then we're going to keep bringing in. And I'm working these it guys. It depends on how many come in yeah. to get well, the autographs. Here's another thing, too. That uh, Quiz Jackson, he's a current player for Tech this year, y'all. Yeah, yeah. So we already had Zamir White and we had Kyrus Jackson. Now we're fixing to have... Quiz so, Jackson so here. Quiz, Quiz Jackson. Jackson. Yes. We're going to have him here. So we're doing current players too. So if somebody's listening on here and they might want well, us Georgia to get Tech Alabama fans. or Tennessee or uh, Florida, hit Nate Lee or John Clayton up, and that way we can get a current player here for you guys too. Okay. Talk about the bundle there. Oh, yeah. we got a whole bundle of... Uh, it's just getting close to football time. You can get the whole whole thing here for 25 and uh we've got actually Alabama. i just noticed there's an orson charles card here yeah it's, it's like a baseball card yeah i think nate lee had the prices on yeah. that i can't remember over there those new prints he left yeah oh yeah quentin banks he left these he actually signed them they're 15 dollars. yeah they're all signed this in here's 15 and then this in here's 25 so you'll have your one of a kind. And he actually signed them, so he's yeah, got he them signed him. already. Yeah. You don't have to come back and get him signed. He's put Go Dogs on them. And you can watch the video. It shows them signing here. Yep. So if you look on the videos and on he, YouTube. He's got these here. They're not signed, but he's got these for 25 And he's got these for 25 Yeah. So. Go to YouTube and check it out, and you'll see where everybody yeah, signed put, everything. Yeah, we'll put it on YouTube. And then also, we've still got some Bama shirts yeah, here. Yeah, Bama. Got a little bit of different stuff. And for the Murray County Indians, we've got their Booney hats here. Yeah. They're 30 bucks. You got the one with the M on it. Hold yeah. it up. Yeah, we got the one with the M. And they're 30 bucks. And the one with the Indian. Yeah. There's the Indian. And they're 30 bucks. Those are pretty. Here's the deal, folks. Uh, and then Melinda, we got Melinda, Flood, and all them, I know they love that I tell you this. Bring cash yeah. on Murray's stuff. Yeah, they cash only. It's cash only because it goes straight to the players. It I goes to the touchdown club. I don't get a percentage of anything. It goes straight to the touchdown club. So if you come to buy these shirts, now these are 20. Yeah, these are the new design. They're yeah. still 20 bucks. They're 20 bucks. But all these. That are, one and that one. Yeah. But the only thing she's went down on, she took $10 these off These are 20. These. They're 20 now. But the rest of these shirts, They're now look 15. how cool this is. All of these, except for these that These shirts one. right here is $10. All of the rest are 10 except, yep. except 10 for 10 bucks for this one. And then, let's see. For women here. That's right, Celeste. Y'all get out there and grab your Murray gear. Football season starts yep. in a couple of so weeks. So right here, this is 10 bucks. That's a pretty, these shirts are so soft, people. Yeah. They, they did good. They are really shirts. soft. But these, the, like I said, the new ones... These are 20. Yeah, these are 10 bucks. These also. are the only ones that are 20. These are 10 bucks. And all of these are 10. But this cash only, and she's also got these here. There's Nike. Yeah. That's not Nike. It don't matter. It's just 10 That's bucks. That's a pullover. Yeah, it's a pullover yeah. for 10 bucks. Yeah. And you can't beat that. Yeah, you can't. And then right here. This Go is, to Hibbets and see how much yeah. a shirt like that costs. This is 10 bucks. Oh, I'll show you They're how much it costs. That's, that's she's the, got this for 10 bucks. I'm going to show you the it's price. It's Nike. And it's right there's the regular price what they were selling for. They're ten bucks, she said. Slay says she loves the new ones. And then let's see here. I'm trying to think. There's all kinds in here. You just had to come through. We got to select sizes. Ten bucks for that one. Yeah. And 
Oh, she, this in here has been a good seller for them, too. Ten yeah, bucks for that Yeah, ten one. bucks. And it's Nike, it's people. It's Nike, ten bucks. Come and support your locals. Yeah, come support your local team here. Yeah, support that Murray County Touchdown Club. Because they, they, need, they, work they hard. need funds for everything for the football team, so that's why we do what we do. Melinda and I and Celeste and all of them, they work yeah, hard. Yeah, they work hard know. at what they do. Yeah. So if you run into them, tell them that JNW Sports said to pat them on the back because uh, they're working hard to make Them this kids have been out there sweating and yep. working hard practicing, oh, too. Brain over here. <laughs> also, Murray County Indians hats. We got these here for 30 bucks. And it's uh, fitted. And they're 30 bucks. So we got those in different sizes. You got the Nike one. Yeah, this is snapback. They're 25. This one be cooler because it's got the holes in the side. Yeah. They're 25. And then we got this in the black. here. And it's also 25. Yeah. And then we got the this girls. one for the girls. It's got the little ponytail hole. Yep, right here. You stick your ponytail through it. Yep. And they're 25. It says Indians on it. Got one Nike visor. Yep. And it's uh, 25 also. Got that. I mean, I mean it's Nike. <laughs> yeah, and then they got this different design with the black. Yeah, it's black. Th you get either black or you can get the white. Yeah, and they're thirty on these here too. We got small, medium, and I think the large. Yeah, we have extra small, large. medium, and large and extra large. You know? So yeah, y'all get out here and y'all support these boys. Yeah, these these guys uh, need it, and they need uh Oh, and also, me and Julie we started a thing, and I, that's I, right. Go. Celeste said the boys have been working their tails off all spring and summer. They're ready for the season to start. Awesome. I can't wait. I can't either. <laughs> uh, also, um, mix 101.5. I can't to, wait to see my nephew play. If you're not able to make the game, they're going to be on the radio uh, again. Remember back in the day, we used to hear, hear Murray County yep, football. Yeah, now they're going to be on the radio. They're going to be on the radio now. Uh, Candace, our uh, rep, Candace Short, I want to give her a shout out. She's our uh, radio rep for. 104.5 mix and that's where Captain Bobby Bird's from. That's our and local Dalton that's station. That's our local Dalton station. Well, she told me back uh, a couple of days ago and I, I told Melinda. Morning, Jonathan Langford. I told uh, Melinda to get with uh, Coach Brewer and they made it happen. That's awesome. So uh, I had a lot to do with the Murray County Indians uh, radio because uh, we made it happen because uh, I thought it was awful crazy that we didn't have radio here for Murray County Yes, yeah, so I got it for Dalton. So now we got them, and I just want to thank uh, Murray County, and I want to thank Candace, because when we worked on that, I told uh, Melinda, so here, take Candace's card. Right. And so that's how we got it going. And I'm so, so happy they're going to be on the radio. they're going to be on the radio, so all these kids, will get people will get to hear their last names on the radio. Right. That's awesome. All right, I'm going to do my shout-outs. If you want to get cowboyed up, you need to go see Tex at Take the Reins. <laughs> it cracks me over until you put that Yeah, Tex, he's, he's got great products. And, you know, Tex is always uh, advertised for us. And yeah. We've advertised for him. I don't get paid for these advertisements. I, just, uh, I help my friends out. Yeah. And so that's why uh, I do this. So if That's you, right, John Rafford, cowboy up. Yeah. If you want to get You're welcome, cow Celeste. cowboyed up, like uh, John Rafford said, you need to go see Tex to take the rain. He's got a little <laughs> bit of everything. He's got colognes. He's got blue jeans. He's even got men out there, if they need work boots, yeah. he's got work boots. Yeah, he's got work boots now. So he does work boots, cowboy boots. He does a little bit of everything. Hats. So tell, tell me, uh, Wes and He's got and tagged. Jerry he shakes hats. From j and Sports, howdy, and <laughs> they'll take care of you. Yeah. There you miss first that's not Tony's. You put that over. No, that ain't it. It's behind it. That. Yeah, you're about there. Okay. Thought you was tall. I am. We got him uh, helping us out here now. Um, our air's giving us a little issue, so he's gonna hopefully get us straightened out. Y'all want an honest person right here. Yeah, he he's really good. Uh He's a real good friend of mine. He actually, I, when I, if you'll go back to the old videos, if it wasn't for Tony, we wouldn't have got open that day. He did everything on the walls. Yeah, he did and, awesome. Uh, nailing everything up. So he did a little bit of everything. So if you need your air conditioning checked out, and you don't need your heater checked out, but if you did need the heat checked out, he can do that too. But right now, we just we got to make sure air, the temperatures we're dealing with, you need someone to come out and check your unit. Yeah. You need to check out Tony Bishop. 
at Central Heat and Air. Yep. And tell them Wes and Julie said, J&W Sports, uh, we sent you. And let's see, what's this in here? Oh, got to say it. Uh, Our good friend David, David Ogle. David Ogle. Yeah, if you want uh, any type of uh, window side, uh, siding or windows put in, you need to get with David Ogle. David said he's covered up. He said, but he appreciates all the advertising we yeah. do. So he said uh, he's a big supporter. Of he's our a big store. supporter in our business. So we advertise him and make sure that we uh, take care of everybody. Trying to see if there's any more. I think that was I ain't it. got a good memory for anything. We've got cards here. Oh, okay. These are good people here. Yeah, they've done a lot of business with us ever since we started this thing. And I'm so happy their business is doing good. Yeah, they've actually put on their... Uh, I'm they, proud of this. They needed help. Yes. Uh, so we advertise them to... If somebody needs a job... You want some good, honest people right here. Yeah, they're good people. Check out B&M Pressure Washington, Brandon and Misty Going. They mm -hmm. do residential and commercial. So they do a little bit of everything. And I want to thank this lady here. Okay. Uh, this lady right here... Uh, Sherry London, she uh, she's been a very supportive uh, customer. Yeah. And we appreciate her business. So if you need a good sale consultant, go you need to her. To go to her at Farmer Home and Furniture. They're really good people too. And uh, we've, uh, like I said, we we want to give shout outs to all the people that tell people about us. Uh, Parker Appliance, yeah. uh, Donut Boutique. Yeah, right over here you got Catherine's Clippers. Clippers. And also Susan's Dance Studio. People say, man, y'all are packed in here. No, it's actually Susan's Dance Studio. Yeah, she's it. right around the corner here, yeah, but we so can't get a picture of her building. So <laughs> usually when my parking lot's full, it's because Susan's got some dancing going on. And this whole parking lot, people's like, I ain't got room to park. And I said, she's got a lot of dancing going on. <laughs> So, if you like to dance, if your daughter likes to dance... Give us a few steps. <laughs> but anyway, if you like to dance, go see Susan and tell her Wes and Tim. Julie said J&W Sports, uh, the, the we sent her out there. We Tim Summy said, it. wow, thanks for getting the Indians back on the radio. Yeah, uh, me and uh, actually Candace York. I, oh, I got to show her card. Oh, here it Candace is. York, she... Uh, yeah, check I, her out. Check her out. Uh, I actually... Uh, gave uh, Melinda a card and I said here I said Murray County Indians football needs to be back on the radio yeah, it she does. Goes, and then Candace goes well I think a long time ago we did have them I said y'all did yeah I don't know what happened but these kids would love that knowing yeah, they're they on would. the radio yeah so they're back on the radio is what Candace told me the other day and so I want to thank uh Melinda and Coach Brewer for making that happen because yeah. they went to Melinda. I gave Melinda a card, and she got with Coach Brewer, and so they made it happen. That's so now awesome. Murray County football will be on 104.5, the mix. And so every time of the games, you get to hear Murray County football. So it's awesome. At the games, you get to hear everything. Tro Troy, said, Troy said Snake should be the voice of the Indians. Oh, Lord. Yeah. I'd mess up more than anything. I'd butcher every player out there. The mom said, it's wrong. <laughs> it's wrong. <laughs> so, no, I ain't doing that. I already butcher enough of the celebrities we bring in. I mean, uh, yeah. Martin, That's going to be awesome. If we can't make it to the game, we'll be able to yeah, hear them on the radio. Yeah, we'll on radio. It's I awesome. love that they did that because a lot of people work, and they yeah. still try to keep support their local teams. Because you're always on Facebook going, who's winning, who's yeah, winning? who's winning? <laughs> well, now you will know. It'll be on the radio yeah, from now on. That's so, awesome. Uh, there's also advertisement. Uh, Candace told me if y'all want advertisement, uh, I've got the Murray County Indians football when you're at the game to advertise. Yeah. So I don't need the radio, but if you need the radio station, when you when the uh, Murray County Indians, when they go to the commercial, the, you'll hear your commercial with Murray County Indians. And support the Murray County Indians because it, it just helps out everybody in this little small town. And yeah, and y'all go out and support them. Go watch yeah, them. Go out Indians watch play. Them. I mean, yeah. Y'all need to rock the house. When they have their first game yeah. open, go out there and rock the house. Make that place so packed. It's awesome how they come out. The oh, music yeah, I love they it. play. Yeah. It's awesome. See, that uh, that right there is a motivator playing yeah. Thunderstruck. I yeah. mean, I thought that was pretty cool. So, yeah, go out and support your Murray County Brought Indians back a lot football of memories. team. <laughs> and the band. Yes. We actually have uh, the band director here. He comes as a customer, so support 
the kids and the band. Oh, and there's there's going to be a marching festival coming up this fall. So, see? I heard that. Murray County Marching so, Festival. There you go right there. I think it'll be called the Fort Mount Marching yeah. Festival. See, I, I remember. Yeah, okay. see, and see right there, I mean, you're supporting everybody. Yeah. So, support all the kids that's playing these sports. And we're working on more sports here at the store. Uh, more like for the kids, youth, uh, football pads. I mean, we're just trying to figure out. We're looking out, into a lot of stuff. Getting a lot of different more stuff in. So support Murray County. Support, well, I always say it, shop Murray first. Keep right. it up because now. Support these local businesses. Yes, we need all the help we can get. Support these restaurants around yeah. here. Yep, and be so kind. Be kind and courteous. Yes. And uh, because right now. They struggle. Everything yeah. is still. Uh, we're still going through this, and uh, people are not wanting to work. Right. And it's bottom line. I wish I could hire somebody because I need a break, but there's no way I can. There's just uh, not enough business in this yeah. little small town. So we bring in the celebrities where you guys will know who we are. Where you, if you want to shop Murray first, you never know who's going to step through the door when you're buying something. So we try to make sure that that's a big slogan we have also. I like uh, supporting Food City, too, because they do a lot. Food City, yeah. Lee Harris and uh, Anthony Hickman, they knocked it out of the park. They brought that food to us. And uh, I think uh, Lee and uh, Anthony, I forgot to tell you this, Zamir White made them a gold plate. Uh, <laughs> Kyrus Jackson did, and I think the other guys did. So they truly appreciate it. They, have about, they, love, they do good for the community, Food City does. Yeah. And J&W Sports appreciates uh you know, Lee and all them guys. Are probably oh, and Ace it. Hardware, too. Ace Hardware, Jeff Hall, and all them. Yeah, they 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 advertise for us. We try to advertise for them. It's just... Uh, and AutoZone. And AutoZone. <laughs> yeah. yeah, AutoZone. They I have. mean, uh, Jerry, I'm, I'm sort of kin to him, and uh, he lets people know if they want sports to come down here and check us out because we carry more than they do in sports. So we've got a little bit of everything. So anyway... It's a hot day. Look over us. Uh, our air's out, but right, we're working it's on it. It's in the works. <laughs> it's in the works. We'll be okay. But if you want to shop here local for your sports, you need to come to JNW Sports. And my slogan is, what kind of fan are you? Just walk in. When you hear me say, what kind of fan are you? Say, Georgia Tech, Alabama, Tennessee, Kentucky, Florida, Georgia. Any team out there, Ohio State, I mean, we try to do it. North Carolina, there's so much. Auburn. And we do special orders. We special orders. But you actually, pay up front. Actually, yeah, you have to pay up front. But actually, uh, I've done Oregon Ducks orders. Mm -hmm. uh, we've done uh, Virginia, West Virginia orders. I mean, we've done a little bit for everybody. So I can special order. But I need to know ahead of time. People call me up all the time and say, hey, can you get me, say, Virginia? And I said, no. And so you don't have it at your store? And I said, no. And they said, well, my, the birthday's tomorrow. So if you call me ahead of time, yeah. I can order you something and already have it here. Yeah. So if you find something on the Internet. Send us, shoot it to shoot us. Shoot it to us on uh, our Messenger. Facebook page. Oh, thank you for people who have liked, subscribed to uh, our YouTube channel. It's growing every day, and thank you all yeah. for that. We've got 34 subscribers. And uh, we've got a lot of likes on some of our videos. So get in there and subscribe. Yeah, subscribe and like. And after we get done here, we put the videos. A lot of people don't like the Facebook, so we use YouTube and also. And Instagram. And Instagram. Yeah, we got Instagram too. And Twitter. You got TikTok, but you and, don't do uh, videos I ain't gonna for do that. A TikTok video, no. <laughs> so we got TikTok because you know for business you got to have a little bit of everything. So we do a little bit of uh, advertising for all of it, but we do. YouTube, when I get off of here, go to YouTube and like and subscribe and check all the videos out. I think I've got 40 videos. This will be 41 or 42 of what I'm doing now. I'm going to put it on YouTube. So we're constantly building ourselves a market. And I always say, what kind of fan are you? Well, I just need to know. You can put it in uh, some of the comments of our videos that we have. What kind of fan are you? You can put who, what kind of fan you are, and I see your name. And Brian Bain said he needs a TikTok from me when it's game time. That's a good idea. When it gets <laughs> game time, we might do that. We might do that. We might have to bring the, uh, the crazy man with the red wig and do a TikTok. Yeah. So, but anyway, thank you guys who came out for the last signing last Saturday. It was amazing. 
Uh, I want to thank the lady who was here at 6.15. I can't yeah. think of her name. But she was here at 6.15 that morning for the signing. That's a true fan. And that's a true fan. <laughs> and I want to thank the guy, and he's in here. Daniel, I don't know your last name because it's uh, like a long name, and I'm not good with long names. Uh, Daniel You're not good from, with short names. Yeah, that, well, true. Uh, Daniel from Jacksonville, Florida. Yeah. These kids ate it up that you drove all the way right. from Jacksonville, Florida to meet them. Well, we had some from Macon. Yeah, Nate Lee go, come Nate up Lee, here. Yeah, Nate Lee are, uh, helps us promote these. And John come and, from and Athens. John comes from Athens. Well, Curious and uh, Zamir from Athens. Right. So, you know, it was a long trip for all of them. Yes, a lot of them came and a long way. And we thank all the support that y'all give us in this little small town. We built a family, a Bulldog family is what I told uh, John. And it just keeps growing with all the players who show the love. Martrez Milner with his shirts wherever they're at. Hanging we, on the wall. Yeah, hanging on the wall. So, I mean, loyalty Martre is everything. Yeah, loyalty is uh, everything, and he has that. Well, we've been so loyal to him, and he's been loyal to us, and we thank everybody who's shopped Murray first. He shopped all shop. these small businesses, and we appreciate it. Yeah. We appreciate everything that you guys do for us, uh, telling people about us. I'm going to get off here. I'm Wes O'Dell. That's Julie Thomason. And just be out here August the 14th. D'Angelo Tyson, we're doing a fundraiser for him for the colon cancer. And this is going to help him with his bills, everything where he won't have to worry a lot. Because we're going to, he's going to get through it. My father got through it. A lot of prayers It's what helped my father. It's going to help uh, Tyson out. And so he needs all the prayers. But he needs you here that day for that fundraiser. Folks, we don't get a dime of that. It's all going. These players are basically just coming up here to help him. Yeah. So I know y'all are not Bulldog fans, but that's love right there. I mean, Rennie Kern is, and uh, John Clayton and all them are working hard. We don't know who's coming. It's surprises. I don't know. So if you want to know, come so out. You, when you want to know, <laughs> it could be a current player. I don't know what Rennie, Rennie talks to so many, Rennie yeah. is very popular. He knows folks. them all. He knows them all. So he could have anybody show up. He could have Mark Ritt show up. He never is, know. You never know who he's going to bring in because he knows so many people. That fundraiser needs to help a Bulldog family that needs a lot of help. And they, they but if you want to go to GoFundMe, to every little bit helps them. So it's August the 14th. August the 14th, 12 to 4, they'll be here. And uh, I don't think you're going to have to be here at 615 or, or... Don't worry, we'll have air. Yeah, we'll have... <laughs> oh, yeah, we'll be done by then. Yeah. I mean, everything will be good by then. But uh, we've got people working on that. But anyway, yeah, we want to thank every Georgia player. I can't remember all names. Georgia players that's been in my store who supported this little small business. And I want to thank Atlanta Braves. Otis Nixon. Otis Nixon has been a big part of this. And John Rocker, uh, all of them have come in here, Atlanta Braves. And I'm going to have eventually more Atlanta Braves. Otis told me he'd like to bring more people in here. So uh, just keep an eye out with Nate, Lee, and John Clayton. You never know who's next. Uh, I'm Wes O'Dell, like I said, from JNW Sports and Apparel. That's Julie Thomason by, behind the, uh, the, the mic and, uh, and the camera. So uh, just come out here and support us locally. We're uh, at 119 East Cherokee Street, Chatsworth, Georgia, 30705. Our phone number, if you have any questions about our business, is 706-971-3385. And also, we have a website for people that this coming up here from Macon and everywhere in Jacksonville, Florida. You can buy off our website. It's www.jnwsportsapparel.com. And YouTube. Oh, yeah, YouTube, uh, J&W Sports Apparel is all it is. John and, Clayton said go dogs. Yeah, go dogs. And thank you, guys. Thank you, John Clayton. Thank you, Nate Lee. And thank you, Teddy Hunt. And thank I you, got, Julie Thomas. And I got to say, go Vols. Oh, God. It's getting that time. Uh, yeah. Get ready for we're, it. Oh, uh, yeah. We're, we're fixing all be arguing and stuff. <laughs> so. But anyway, we want to thank everybody that's made this uh, family we built. And we thank about everybody who has supported us. And uh, my old place uh, off of 40, uh, 4260 Highway 76 where it all started. And uh, 
Go ahead. Uh, Jeremy Nick said thank y'all and Jeremy and John Clayton and Nate Lee for putting these events together. Yeah, they were. You're hard. welcome, Jeremy. Just keep coming out yeah. and supporting them. Yeah, we thank we thank uh, John Clayton and we thank Nate Lee for everything they yeah, do. Yeah, they do awesome job. If you see them in events, they're either giving our business cards out to let these guys know what we got going on. We built a family, and I love. I got. Give him a shout out, Martrez Milner. I called him Martinez when I first started. I butchered <laughs> his name, but Martrez Milner. He actually said when he leaves here, and it makes me and Julie feel good, and so does Big Max. See you later, family. Yeah. I mean, who would ever thought this? I'm is a, a Tennessee town. fan, but yeah. I still enjoy. Yeah. He what, he said he people. said I'll talk to you later, family. Is what they call us. So yeah. we've built a good relationship. They tell us family and. Well, like I told uh, Morris and uh, Kyrus Jackson and all them, they're, they're family now. I mean, so we got a Bulldog family, and so we're going to keep it going. And hopefully, much as I hate to say it, we'll have a Georgia Tech family. We'll have a uh, Auburn family. Tennessee. Tennessee. I mean, it starts a family. And my slogan is, what kind of fan are you? And it's growing, people. And it's growing, yeah. people. Uh, we always say, what kind of fan are you? That's my slogan, so I've got to carry it all. I know, Jeremy. He said I was worried Wes was going to have a stroke last weekend, but he pulled it out. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and I want to thank Captain Bobby Bird. He sat out here, y'all. I took three waters out there. He was fine. He kept didn't miss a beat, and he just kept going on the radio station to advertise us. And so that was truly remarkable because he was out in his heat and uh, doing his thing. So if you need any advertisement, check out 104.5 The Mix and tell them JNW Sports You're really welcome, highly Jerry. recommends them. And we truly appreciate everybody who shows so much love. And uh, I'm going to be on the radio. I'll have to get with Candace and find out a time. Maybe she's watching uh, when I'm going to be on the radio. And uh, maybe I can find out a time and that way I can post say, hey, listen to the radio station. And basically, it's going to be... So don't for, forget, August 14th, 12 yeah. to 4. Uh, yeah, that's why I'm going on the radio. A lot of people don't do Facebook, so I'm going on the radio, and it's going to be Delonjo, Delonjo, D'Angelo. D'Angelo Tyson. Uh, we're doing a fundraiser for him. And I'm sorry to butcher your name, sir, if you're watching. I, I'm not good at names. D'Angelo. D'Angelo Tyson. And uh, I'm going to go on the radio and let everybody know we have a fundraiser. And we don't know who's showing up, so I can't really say anybody. I'll say, I just know, just show up is what I'm going to tell them on the radio station. So what I'm going to do, I'll, maybe Candace can let it, text me a time or something that, that Bobby will want me in the studio. And once we do that, get the word out, folks, because this is a fundraiser, and these guys really need all the help they can get. So I'm going to get off here. Thank you, guys. We, pre we truly appreciate all the love you show us. Go Braves, go Dogs, and go Indians, and we'll talk to you very soon. And go Vols.